superhero. I'm ready to do some damage. <laughs> What's up, guys? This is Mad Squash 94 here, and welcome back to another Smite Weekend video. And looks like we got Mercury, and we've played up, Mercury sexy? a couple times now here on Smite Weekend. I believe we played as this skin, and we played as <laughs> this skin already. Let's try playing as this one. This mirror edge looking skin. That's the skin we're gonna play as today. And it could go in our favor, it might not. Who knows? But we'll see how it works out. Nonetheless. All right, so if you guys look at, our, at the thing, at our board here, our scoreboard, our our illumination, our preview of all the gods that are here. Um, let's see here. We have a Thor on our team who is an assassin. We have an Artemis who is a hunter. I'm Mercury, and I am an assassin. And we have a Huyi who is a hunter, and we have a Rama who is a hunter. And on the other team... They have a Thanatos, who is an assassin. They have a Geb, who is a guardian. They have a Discordia, who is a mage. And then they have a Janus, who is a mage. And a Capri, who is a guardian. All right, slowpokes, try and keep up. There ain't no slackers on my team. There we go. All right, so as we've done in the past, and we shall keep doing this, we will get Bloodforge to begin. Since this is an assassin, and this is... Assault, we always start with that item as an assassin. Unless something new comes out where I'm like, oh, it trumps it. But we'll get a one or two or three or four, and then we'll get a one again. Because it's the thing we're going to be poking other people with the most. And then that's what we'll get. And, I'm, and this is the, since this is the third video of Mercury. Oh, jeez, I know just ulted. <clears throat> um, so you guys basically know how his kit works, and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen other enemies or allies Mercury's as well enough now to know like what he's all about, what he's got, what he presents to the table as of uh, opportunities for us. But hopefully we win. Um, the only thing I'm concerned about is um, each and every one of us does physical damage. AKA Geb and Janus. No, Geb and uh, uh, Kepri, excuse me. We're gonna have a hard yeah, time with they're, If they're smart, and I'm sure they are, they will all build just straight up physical protections. Um, Geb really didn't. We got um, health. And I'm not sure where Kepri got. Um, he's starting to get the freaking, you know. The physical Damn it! Bad start. That was my fault. I shouldn't have rushed in. I really shouldn't have done that. That was definitely my fault. Um, don't know why I did that. <clears throat> Alright, let's see how we can pull this out. Let's see if we can try to salvage what I, my screw up. Smell you later. Gotta start trying to get minions. Get some XP so we can get minions, you know? Get minions so we can get XP, rather. Alright. See here? I can't really just go in as much as I would love to. Silly ally. That is for enemies. Yeah, definitely. Defend. I mean, yeah, we have to. Um, they're pretty fat at this point. At least Capri and Discordia are. They're both level 7. I'm still level 6 now. Rama just hit level 6. He was just level 5. See, this is the part that screwed me up anyways in the first place. Because I want to go in there and uh, it just ended up being all bad. Nope, 
enemy here. An enemy has been slain. I'll make them pay. Group up. Depend on yourself. Oh, I don't know if you were telling me. Depend. Okay, this match is so far is really just a spot. I feel like she just popped out. Yeah, that makes sense. Damn. I don't know what I expected. Okay. Not good. Thanks. Thank you. Yeah, try and stop. Smell you later. Thank you in there. Damn. I'm having a hard time trying to this must play my tech and exactly how to get in there because, like, as you notice, they're just shutting us down at every turn here. Should be dead. Yeah, yeah. If we end up winning, this would be Group crazy. Up. Please? Group up. Smell you later. So far, they, the enemy team definitely has the ability. And I can't just get in there at all, because like it's not gonna do me much of anything. You know? An ally has been slain. Oh, that's not good. Good game. Out of Be right Enemy Yeah, that makes sense. Totally out of mana. I'm out of mana. Please? Come on, guys. Fall back, please. Who you gotta listen, man. We're already having a rough time as it is. I can't find good ways to get in there. How am I looking? Not, I don't have top of anything. Eh. Rama is doing the best on our team. That's good. At least in my opinion, yeah. He's the only one who kills on our team. Artemis doesn't really have a super good excuse. I don't know. It doesn't help that we don't have any tanks either. And we're all physical, pr physical protection. It's like, like, you know. We all do physical damage. Ooh, with that. I don't know what I expected. Uh, That's unfortunate. Nice job. Our Rama is extremely salty. Yeah, I don't blame him. There we go. Good job. Finally, something here. What are you doing? Are you crazy? There's nobody there! I'm dead. Mess me up. Sorry! Awesome! I 
should go back. All right, what do I do? Kind of can't. I gotta get Japan. stuff. Obviously, I think I Titans may probably want to be a bad choice, considering they have two tanks. Like it's, it's gonna be getting. It's gonna make us hard for us to like penetrate them at all. So Titans Bane early on probably won't be a bad choice. Getting these katanas probably also wouldn't be a bad choice as well. This must be Um, yeah, it's the same word I think. Um, I must die again. That's good. And then I think we'll start getting some other pots. We're not gonna get. We're not gonna fill out on our pots, but we're gonna get some pots. You know. Um. I got a kill though at least now, which is which is good. This game is totally this match is totally foobard though it seems. Like, you know, I don't think it's salvageable. If it is somehow then um it'd be quite a feat if we won. Okay. How are we looking? Artemis is zero in six. Oh my goodness. Not good. Nope, not getting hit by that. Can't afford it. Thanks. There we go. Did something. Good. I'm trying to kill that Thor as fast as I possibly could. They all retreated. Didn't work out the way I was hoping. Attack middle tower. Okay, we did get tower a bit. I wasn't able to do any damage to it, unfortunately, because, like, I wouldn't be able to get out, I don't think. An ally has been slain. I don't know what I expected. Damn. Oh. Oh, wow. There's really good. Gotta escape. Gotta get out. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, that's no fun. Damn it. That's me up. You have been slain. Oh, well. Um, let's see here. People are targeting some of these swords. I'm not going to get all of them, I don't think. Um, like, I think Stone King Sword wouldn't be bad. Master Mune also wouldn't be terrible. And so, our hero story mm. I think we'll start working on Masamu thing. And when we do be able to finish it, they'll give us 50 physical power, they'll give us 150 health, give us 7% movement speed, and for each enemy goblin, 55 units of you, you gain a stacking buff that provides 7 magical protections and 7 physical protections, and then I will stack up to 5 times. Um, I think that'll help. Obviously, it's not going to help us as much as I would like it. See, I could ult again in there, but I do just die. There's no point. Do some damage for what? To die? You know? Like it doesn't seem all that logical. Miss. Wow, that hit me. Come on! Okay. One thing I'm not gonna get for this whoa, for this particular build, I'm not gonna get crit because the fact they have a gem on their team is gonna make it hard for us to do anything. Like that. I would love help. 
I got a, I got a white thing, boy. Unlike his victims, our hero was just I don't know what I expected. Alright, we can't get Masamune just yet. Unfortunate. But we do gotta wait. Let's see, we're good. Let's raise this. Artemis, what are you Artemis building? This must be your parents' field. Nothing good. Silly Asai, first item. Is that, is that right? Yeah, Double she got kill. Asai. Killing That's a good life steal, though, which is good. Try not to consider how bleeding it's just a little bit of everything, is. you know? But it's not, like, particularly great. And then she's got boots. She's got some crit. The crit's not going to help her against Gab. This game is... Mm. Your titan's under attack. A new threshold. I don't see a way we can escape this. And win. Come on. This is ridiculous. Wait a minute, No, I'm not getting hit by that. I could try to bait everybody. An ally has been slain. Oh fuck. And so our hero story begins. Oh well. What do you do? I mean, you can't win a ball. This team is just better than our team, you know? Uh, I mean, we have two people that don't even have kills, which is unfortunate, but they're trying. Your team did something. You know? So, I mean, it's good that they're trying their best if they can. It's unfortunate that it's just not the greatest thing in the world for us right now. What else are we gonna get? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe we get Erendite. Hmm? Maybe? Possibly Aaron died. Now that's what I'm talking about. we didn't lose, honestly. Not Super like Sonic already. I'm building stacks. That's Ultimate great. You can build stacks all day, boy. What are you doing? You're crazy. I need help, man. Help, please. This must be your parents' field. Why can't you be more like your ally? Artemis did a thing. That's good. Yeah, that makes sense. Be mad. There we go. That's long enough. Grupa! Grupa! No, Artemis! Try and stop. Come on, dude. It's a trap. Retreat. Rom was alive. That's it. It's not gonna be alive for much longer, though. Rampage. Shit. I'm sorry, buddy. I tried. Cause he, I know he's doing the best on our team, so I'm kind of, I'm definitely trying to do best to help him succeed. I could ult. My ultimate's not gonna do it. Oh well. You have that. Um, let's see, what was I gonna get? Aerodite, that's what I was gonna say, right? Right. And what Aerodite does is a 6-5 physical power that does 10% cooldown reduction. And that's good. And the ultimate ability has finished casting, and then casting your next ability, it reveals on the 
20 units for 8 seconds while moving towards revealed enemies gain 30% 30% movement speed and when first striking a revealed target they take an additional 40 plus 30% of your physical power this can occur once every 45 seconds all right and listen he's screwed your titan's under attack Shit. I keep missing. Oh, I can give you health. There you go. Hey, shit. Kill him. Ow. Ow, I'm gonna die here. I bet you saw that going through the gate. Oh, no! That's no fun. What a rude dude. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, I mean, like you do, you know. How are we looking? I'm four and seven. Our Thor is zero oh and seven. Our Hui is one and seven. Our Artemis is one and ten, and Rom is five and five. Rom is doing the best. I'm doing second best, but my record. Unfortunately. Um, and it looks like we're gonna lose this. There's no going around it. I come up in round 10 seconds. It looks like they're kind of toying with us as a team. Unlike his so it seems. Our hero was yeah. destined to continue. And living. that's cool. I didn't know Ramo was alive though. Hmm. Maybe. Just maybe. I got an alt. Enemy has been slain. Come on. Smell you like a circle of life, my dude. Your team did something. Come on, I'll get this guy. Whoa! <laughs> I would love to be able to get crits right now, but I just can't because of the gap. It's not going to help. An ally has been slain. Yeah, see, like, the Artemis does nothing to the gap. And it's, and I'm, it's unfortunate. Our team needs to help get us up there. And they're slow behind. Especially Hu Yi and who are mostly close. Up. Come on. Pretty hurt. I made a full place as ultimate. Thankfully. Silly ally. That was the whole was your enemy. point of me doing the way, that the way I did. This must be how your parents feel. Retreat. However, it's not gonna be Retreat. enough for us, I don't think. Smell you later. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't know what I It's over. Your middle phoenix is under attack. No, I'm not gonna surrender, but mm. I can't get one there. It's, it's, it's super done so. Your titan's under attack. And so our your story begins. They're all dead, and I feel Oh well. And that is the result of our game. And it ended up being decimating for us as a team. And I just, I mean, look at the kill difference. It was, it was 14 kills to 44. Like, if that doesn't tell you 
I didn't have a good team. I don't know what did. I wasn't playing the greatest either, and I was trying to do what I could. But um, the enemy team getting fed to the point of unwinnability also was a big factor for us. Unfortunate, really. However, um, you do have games that way on both sides, you de where you totally decimate them on that standpoint, or you get decimated. And and it, it's not something you can just, I don't know, too easily, I guess. Let's see here. Rama, I'm going to give you guide to start, okay? We'll start with you, and I'll work our way around. Everyone else, I guess, friendly. Nobody else was worth anything. It was just me and Rama, really. Unfortunate. Okay, leveled up on the battle pass, though. Now let's yeah. take a look here. We'll start with myself. I got four kills and eight deaths. Hey. I went negative by four. I don't go negative often in this game. But I went negative. And then, uh, I did what I could here and there. But, um, there was, there was not a whole of good good opportunities to go and like initiate for our team. I got away and lived for for a couple of the initiates that I did, thankfully. However, it just didn't work out, as you saw. And the fact that I had a gem also dictated how my build swayed a bit. Otherwise I would have put some crits in there. Maybe I would have got more kills. Probably should have got boots. It's probably one of the things I should have got in there. Probably should have got boots instead of like Titan's Bane or Masamune first but i got the way i did and that's the result next up we have artemis who got two kills 11 deaths one of the worst ones on our team her build not a horrid build at all however the fact they had gab alone on their team made it so whenever she would shoot at gab it made everything Null and void, basically. Like you, because if, if the crit damage would do 25%, the total damage it would have been doing, you know. So yeah, that was the raw salt of that. Next up, we have Thor. Went zero and nine, got zero kills, nothing, did nothing. Building kind of tanky. Trying to build sort of like a tank, and if he did that, I wish he would have tanked more than he did. But he didn't do a very good job, and and it showed. Hu Yi, one kill. Nine deaths. Okay. Bloodforge like me. Yeah. Good start. Boots, not terrible. ASI, mm, shouldn't have done that. Really shouldn't have done that. Keen size. Should have got keen size. Artemis and Hu Yi should have got keen size. Never did. Because it would have done, it would have done uh, a percentile damage first start. Especially against tanks. Never did that. So that's partially why our, the majority of our hunters did as bad as they did. And then let's go down to Rama. Got seven kills. And seven deaths. Rama broke even, thankfully. He didn't. He didn't get positive, unfortunately. But he was. He didn't get negative. Um. He got Odysseus ball, followed by Boots, Keen Size, Jotun's Wrath. Jotun's Wrath. I think it's what's called. A Psy, which isn't the best. And then he was working on Executioner. That looks like. Now Keen Size was a very good choice. I would got Blood Forge and then Keen Size if I was Rama. In his standpoint, but it made it made itself work for a while, and uh, the result of our team being a whole lackluster of 14 total kills is horrendous. Oh. On the other team, though, they have a, their gem went three and three, the Janos went 11 and two, the Thanatos went 10 and five, their Discordia went 11 and two, and their Kepri went nine and two. So yeah, they did really well overall as a team. Um, I mean, you have matches like this, you just get decimated. And there's no I don't know. There's no particular yeah. good way to make sure that doesn't happen. You just, it just depends on sort of your teammates. I did. I didn't do the best, obviously, and I did really bad from my normal standpoints as what I do for this character. However, it didn't help that we had three other characters in our team, making it so it was almost unwinnable, unplayable. But that was the result of that. Um, let's see. How are we looking? Earn the most gold. Hey. Who did? Who did? Who? Uh, no, excuse me. Rama did. I almost did by 200 gold short. I was close. But Rama earned us the most gold. Player damage. Who earned us the most player damage? It was indeed Artemis. Because she was hitting her things for the majority of the part, but it was all null and void when concerning the fact that you're attacking somebody like Geb. And it's all coming back to Geb. Because I remember Geb tanked quite a bit. He was the very front man for their team. It wasn't Capri, it was Geb. 
and she kept shooting at him, and it didn't work out. Hmm. Minion damage. Who did the best <laughs> for minions? Um, it was Rama. No surprise. He was doing really well. And then who took the most damage? It was two, 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 Thor. And he mitigated the most, too. But together, he took 43 grand damage. It's impressive, I guess. Structure damage. I didn't get any. I couldn't get any. I couldn't get in there. Neither could Thor. Um, resulting in only our hunters got some damage in the towers. And we didn't, I don't even think we took a tower. We didn't take any. We just couldn't get in there. Player healing. Um, I got the most player healing. <sighs> Big deal that did for us, considering the fact that we lost anyways. But uh, none of it's. Uh, we have these games sometimes where just this stuff yeah. happens. It's unfortunate. Anyways, this my weekend was um. I don't know. I guess a total bust. We didn't win anything. Um, we got some pretty bad matches, and and it just didn't go in our favor. It, and then it, this really happens here and there. Um, it's unfortunate, but it happens. But uh, if you guys did like this video somehow, feel free to leave that like. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think I should have built for Mercury. Give me recommendations for builds I probably should have had against this layout of a team that I was versing. I would love to hear it. Give me some ideas so I can verse that in the future. And, you know. And then um, if you're not subscribed to me, um, please hit the subscribe button and then ring the bell to get notified of my future videos. And then um, I'll talk to you guys all in the next episode of Smite Weekends. Have a good one, guys. And um, hopefully you don't go and get a bad team like this one. Have a good one.